week 13 thursday a reading from a homily of saint jerome to the newly baptized i will go to the place of the wonderful tabernacle like the deer that yearns for the fountains of water so my soul is yearning for you o god as those deer then yearn for the fountains of water so it is with our dear they have come out of egypt and left the world they have slain pharaoh and all his army in the waters of baptism now after slaying the devil they yearn for the fountains of the church the father the son and the holy spirit that the father is a fountain is related in jeremiah they have forsaken me the fountain of living waters and hewed cisterns for themselves broken cisterns that can hold no water we read elsewhere of the sun they have forsaken the fountain of wisdom again of the holy spirit whoever drinks of the water that i shall give him there will rise up in him a fountain of water welling up to eternal life straight way the evangelist explains that the savior was speaking of the holy spirit these quotations clearly demonstrate that three fountains of the church are the mystery of the trinity the soul of the believer of the baptized person yearns for these fountains and he says my soul has thirsted for god the living fountain his was no mild wish to see god he yearned with all his ardor he thirsted with burning passion before receiving baptism they spoke with one another and said when shall i come and appear before the face of god see what they asked for has come to pass they have come and stood before the face of god they have appeared before the altar and the sacred mysteries of the savior admitted to the body of christ and reborn in the life giving fountain they speak with confidence and say I will go to the place of the wonderful tabernacle even to the house of God the house of God is the church this is the wonderful tabernacle for in it is the voice of exaltation and praise and the sound of those who keep festival you who have now put on Christ and follow our guidance are like little fish on the hook you are being pulled up out of the deep waters of this world by the word of god and so you can say in us nature is changed for fish which are taken out of the sea die but the apostles have fished and taken us out of the sea of this world in such a way that we have been brought to life from the dead while we were in the world our eyes were in the depths and our life was spent amidst the mire when we were snatched from the waves we began to see the sun we began to gaze upon the true light and troubled with excess of joy we set our souls hope in god for i shall praise him my savior and my god